Hello again viewers, we're here today at another job, uh, we're replacing some storage heaters, four in total today, so we're taking storage heaters off the wall and placing them with panel, electric panel heaters. So these are the electric panel heaters, uh, Dimplex, and they're the PLXE panel heaters, these are the 2 kilowatt versions. This is the customer's existing storage heaters. You can see the old storage heaters with the bricks. These are about sort of 15 years old now, so uh, time for a replacement. Okay, so we're just uh, taking off one of the storage heaters off the wall. I'm about to uh, affix the new one. So we're just finishing off our cleaning up process. As you can see, there's a tiny bit of dust just there on the floor, but we have our rubble sack and everything ready uh, to uh, sweep up. I'm going to use the uh, nice DeWalt Aquavac as uh, our mini hoover on this job as well. And we're all tidied up and now we're ready to fit our new panel heater. So there it is, nice and simple, out the box. So we're just going to attach it to the wall now. These are plasterboard walls. So we're going to use these, Grip It, the world's ultimate plasterboard fixings. Dead easy and simple to use. Literally so easy, just drill, tap and turn, as the instructions say. It gives you the size for what you need, what the safe load is for whatever colour. And you're just using a flat blade bit, as in the instruction diagram. You just drill out with your flat blade bit. I don't have a 15 currently, um, out of the new uh, Bosch ones that I bought. So I've got a 16 mil, but on, our, on the previous one in the other room that we did, 16 was perfectly adequate. Use the yellow screwed out, drilled out, tapped it in, turned it, and it's lovely and tight against the wall, as if you've drilled into a normal brick wall using a regular uh, red raw plug. They provide the screws as well with this pack, so you get the assorted kit up to 32. Grip it, would definitely recommend it. So there we have one of the yellow grip it fixings attached into the wall. And above it the second one and that's how it looks when it's completed the bracket that comes with the panel heater and then all you have to do is just screw that up to the wall so here we are with our bracket now hanging on the wall nice and secure having used our grip it fixings so this is the finished article with the panel heater on the wall it's got a nice display currently showing at seven and then makes a nice little noise as you cycle up through so 26 degrees is the maximum and seven degrees is the minimum setting which is the frost protect which for this evening, because we're coming back here tomorrow, uh, I'll leave on and uh, we'll test and uh, sort out the other ones tomorrow. Okay, so that's it. A job done for the day. It's about half past six now and we're trundling on our way home through uh, the usual traffic now the kids are back at school. So, uh, thanks very much for watching, uh, if you have been, uh, to steal a phrase from uh, Fully Charged. Apologies there. Robert and uh, if you've enjoyed watching this video uh, please click like if you'd like to see more videos then by all means click subscribe uh, and that way uh, I can get somewhere close to the amount that Thomas Nagy has there's a nod to Tom uh, I enjoy your videos sir so uh, please keep making them and uh, anybody that's uh, enjoying watching his may enjoy watching mine maybe not what do you reckon Jay okay Adiós.